Hello and welcome to my first ever product review. Today I will be reviewing this. It's a, a mini Kana wood plane. It's a traditional Japanese wood plane. Quite, uh, different from the Western style planes. It's, it's not a push plane, but rather a pull plane. The Japanese uh, believe that it gives you more control of what you're doing. First things first, it did arrive in an authentic Japanese uh, newspaper. You can see the date. And seeing that it's a product review from the UK, I don't know if the Japanese have a very good sense of humour or it was just um, coincidence. We have there what looks to be Theresa May navigating the front, the bow of the ship, away from the rest of the ship. Little detail, but I guess that's just, it could be just their sense of humour. Anyway, down to business. First thing to note on a Japanese wood plane is that unlike the Western styles, it is not uh, perfectly flat. It's designed not to be perfectly flat. It will have, it will rock. From what I can uh, research, the Japanese have done that on purpose, so you don't have uh, the wood is not in contact all the time, giving you a better surface. To right, let's take the the blade out. Push with your thumb and hit on the back. That's the body of the of the plane. Nice hardwood. If anybody can tell me what that says, it'd be greatly appreciated. And this is the blade. Has no Markings from the factory, looks good quality steel, it will be need, it will need to sharpen that but we'll get to that in just a moment. Unlike other Japanese planes, it's got this which seems to be a chip breaker. So the blade goes in there and your chip breaker goes there, giving you, supporting your, the cutting blade. Right, let's sharpen this blade. I like to sharpen my blades using an oil stone, this is an Indian oil stone. It's got coarse on one side. and fine on the other side. It's got no chips, no dents, so I don't think it would be using the core side for this blade. Now you can, you can sharpen it using the jig like this. like that or you can sharpen it by hand I prefer to sharpen it by hand and I'll leave you a link in the description uh, of uh, the best YouTube uh, tutorial for hand sharpening right all right I finished sharpening it and as you can see from the shiny parts I think I got pretty good age. After using my oil stone I went on to the leather. Right, but this is not a review on sharpening, so we'll review about the 
block plane. So let's reassemble this. It's just showing there. I don't know if you managed to make that out. Let's see. I think that does quite a nice job. I think that's my first ever plane that I've reviewed. I can't really judge it against other products. I probably need to align it a little bit more. It looks like it's cutting mostly from the left hand side. See the finishes. It's quite nice. It's a it's a cheap plane, but I'll sharpen it a bit more. Have a bit of practice, and it should be quite useful. Well, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this short review, and I'll leave the, the links on uh, on the description as to if you want to learn how to uh, hand sharpen your your tools and till the next time thank you